Hello everyone, I am recording this video to help you circumvent the limitations of the email function within iLab. I want to show you how to export your raw data from your core. Uh, you'll note that I am at the reporting tab for the university overall, but the uh, reporting function and the export data function work the same from within your respective core or course. So, the first thing you're going to do is navigate to your core. Click there. You'll go to My Cores. Select whichever one you want to. And then one of the core pops up. You'll just simply go to the Reporting tab. So, uh, again, once you're here, you'll go ahead and hit Load Default. Or if you have a saved report, you can load a saved report. Um, in this instance, I'm going to tell you that uh, whichever date you choose is not really super meaningful, except that it will dictate how iLab applies this the date fil filter. So what I would say is to shoot early in the start and shoot late in the date and then it doesn't really matter because all three of those dates will come through in your data. For this instance I'm gonna just leave it with the April 1 and April 30th just so that we're not sitting here waiting forever for iLab to run the report or export the data. So hit load default. If you do change the dates you'll need to rerun the report. I guess I lied. And then as soon as it's done reporting, all you have to do is come to this export function, click source data as CSV XLS, be a little patient, and either this screen will pop up and your download will be downloaded. Um, occasionally you will run into a big blue error screen with giant white letters that says that the server ran into an error. I have found that 99% of the time that's somewhat of a lie. Um, the error is that it didn't automatically download the file. If you hit F5 or refresh in your browser, the error will be overcome and your uh, file will still be downloaded. So keep that in mind. Uh, that's it for exporting the data. I'll break this up into manageable bits. We'll get into how to extract the emails in the next one. All right, thanks. Bye-bye.